Sylvan meant savage in those primal woods Piero di Cosimo so loved to draw, where nudes, bears, tigers, sows with women's heads, mounted and murdered and ate each other raw, nor thought the lightning kindled bush to tame, but flabbergasted fled the useful flame. Reduced to patches owned by hunting squires of villages with ovens and a stock they whispered still of most unsocial fires. Though crown and mitre warned their silly flocks, the pastures humdrum rhythms to approve and to abhor the license of the grove. Guilty intention still looks for a hotel that wants no details and surrenders none. A wood is that and throws in charm as well, and many a semi-innocent undone has blamed its nightingales, who round the deed sang with such sweetness of a happy greed. Those birds, of course, did nothing of the sort. And as for sylvan nature, if you take a snapshot at a picnic, oh, how short and lower orders the gang will look by those vast lives that never took another and are not scared of gods, ghosts, or stepmother. Among these coffins of its by and by, the public can, it cannot on a coast, bridle its skirt and bargain chasing eye. And where should an austere philologist relax but in the very world of shade from which the matter of his field was made? Old sounds re educate an ear grown coarse, as Pan's green father suddenly wraps out a burst of undecipherable morse, and cuckoos mock in Welsh and doves create in rustic English over all they do to rear their modern family of two. Now here, now there, some loosened element, a fruit in vigor or a dying leaf, utters its private idiom for dissent, and late man, listening to his latter grief, hears close or far the oldest of his joys, exactly as it was the water noise. A well-kempt forest, begs Our Lady's grace. Someone is not disgusted, or at least is laying bets upon the human race, retaining enough decency to last. The trees encountered on a country stroll reveal a lot about that country's soul. A small grove massacred to the last ash, an oak with heart rot, give away the show. This great society is going smash. They cannot fool us with how fast they go, how much they cost each other and the gods. A culture is no better than its woods.